All right. That's a, you know, it's an interesting question. I, um, when I, it was July 2nd, I'll never forget, 2002, and it was at SEC offices and they announced my appointment. And I'm thinking about the future. I, I mentioned, I may actually listed the various uh, challenges. And I was more focused on the actual challenge at the time than I was on the outcome. So, um, and then we put our, we went to work and the outcome has been very gratifying. But I don't think I could say that I had, I, I knew what the outcome was going to be or that I really anticipated what it was going to be. But I knew that this was a terrific league with great people and that if we could meet the challenges, we could, we could meet our potential. And I think we're on our way towards fulfilling our potential. Commissioner, do you think that the playoff system that starts in 14 is a long-term deal, or do you see it being adjusted just as it needs to end when someone adjusted over a period of time? I think we have a 14 playoff. We evaluated all the other models. Um, and determined that we were going to have a 14 playoff. I think a 14 playoff meets um, the the uh, concern that we protect the regular season. It's the best in all sport. It means two teams play one more game, so it doesn't impact uh, the student athlete, you know, in a way in which a full bone playoff would do. So I don't, uh, at least uh, with the people that are currently involved. And uh, the the the, the uh, concern about additional games, I don't see us going beyond four. Is there a concern that will destroy the current bowl system? Well, I think there are a lot of issues that relate to an expanded uh, playoff. Uh, that's certain. You know, they're, they're, I'm not sure that would be the primary one, but. Uh, uh, though there's a whole litany of reasons why we felt that uh, a, a 14 plan. What interests me the most is that you're asking me all these questions about going beyond four. We haven't even got to four. So that gives you some sense of how well we've satisfied everybody, right? Well, I, you know, it was six months of meeting and talking. It was uh, a commitment to do what we thought was best for college football, balancing that with what we, uh, with our responsibilities for being, for taking care of our own conferences. Um, and then uh, I think what we did on, I, I may be off on the dates, but I think as early as April the 6th, we issued a list of all the potential options or models that could be thought about. And then, uh, and then late April, we, uh, we, we met and we said that publicly that we were going to take a 14 playoff model to the presidents and chancellors. And then there was some other discussions. Of the, when I say president, I mean the Presidential Oversight Committee. And then uh, we were able to work through some difficult issues. Um, so in the final analysis, we brought for their consideration what we said we were going to do when we announced it earlier on in, uh, in early April. What I, what I was saying really was that uh, intercollegiate athletics is part of the overall mission of the university. It's, it, and it needs to be uh, conducted in that way. Um, and it behooves all of us in, in, in every level to continue to make sure that whatever we do athletically, we do it within the within the academic mission and the administrative mission of the entire university.